Chapter 24, Taking Out the Trash. A filthy final, the Holiday Trash Hill. Oh! <laughs> Oh, he's calling in reinforcements. You know, I was halfway joking about it becoming a, uh, a shooter, like at the end of Devil May Cry. It might actually be that now. Gladly. Merry Christmas, Jack. Alright, well maybe not if he's running off with the sled. Gonna be more like Shadows of the Colossus, I guess. What is over here? I don't think there's anything left to, to do with the town square. Pretty sure we bought everything from the witches. Um, guess we could fill up. No. There we go, full health. All our vials should be full. Witch's shop, the best bargain in town! Oh, we get some more blue souls and red souls. Oh, I did it again. And you, I don't think, have anything. Alright, we're good. I'm sure there's lots of, like, hidden missions I've missed. But we're not gonna we're not gonna go looking for those. We're gonna go fight the final boss of the game. We've been at this for a long time. It's time to see the conclusion. And there's Igor eating his chips. Actually, since we're here, do you guys have anything to say? No matter where you go, Jack. I'll always... Oh. It's alright, Sally, we know. All the holiday leaders are safe at home. Now we should make Ugi pay. Shouldn't we? We should, right? Well, technically, yes. You go get that Ugi. Then we celebrate. Yep, we'll have a big dance party. No, we're going to the Holiday Trash Hill. Alright. Well, Lon, this might be our last chance to talk. You finally caught up with Oogie. You'd better go into this battle prepared. Do you want me to pour Halloween Town Spring Water into your crystal vial? Uh, I think we're all filled up, but yeah. Don't forget. Save it now. Or risk doing it again. Um, nothing really to save, I guess.
the big bad boss fight. Quite literally. You know what? He, he kind of reminds me of like a, uh, 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 what is it, Gigantamax Garbodor? I get it. We gotta go Pumpkin King. Did he shrink? I think he shrunk a little bit. <laughs> We're supposed to jump on his back? Ouch. is the big part of it. But I'm curious, like, there was the one... There was, like, the one spot that made it look like it was on jump on his back or something. I guess that's it. We're just gonna run circles around them. Try to find the different uh, gas pipes that are going. Sub on fire. There's one. Come on, you. You big goon. Now, he seems like he's shrinking. Maybe those are just to avoid his attacks. Ouch. Okay, I think we're nearby. There we go. Come on, you. Maybe I'm supposed to avoid his attacks uh, by jump, not jumping, but uh, you know, soul rubber on one of those hooks. Let's give it a shot. Nope. Okay, there's the gas over there.
Come on, you. Kaiju. When I say trash kaiju, I don't mean Hedora. What did you do? Did you like fall? You doing a ground pound? So yeah, we just gotta keep running around like this. I can hear the gas again. Come on. There. One more time. At least I think one more time. Oh, it's back that way. Okay. He's right next to it, too. Come on, you. You big goon. Ouch. we do. Alright, so phase two. see if all our other song and dances made us ready for this one. Oh, it's powering up. I'm missing all the interesting, like, singing and dancing because I'm trying to keep up on the button prompts. Oh, 
That one was close. The combo was nice and high. So was our exclamation points. Looks like we did it. We did it. Clear time. time, not great. Combo. Combo. Yeah, we probably had to do... Marks count. Yeah, to S-rank everything, we probably need to do the song without... without making a mistake. But not bad. Okay, so I guess this is it. Sandy's got his own sleigh back. There, I thought I was too late, but I managed to deliver the presents in time. I'm so forgive me for causing you trouble again. No, Jack, it's not your no, fault. Jack, this time I owe you my gratitude. Thank you for saving my life. And off he goes. Merry Christmas! Oh, ho, ho. I was so scared, Jack. You know, it's strange. Whenever I set out to find something new, my eyes are open to a larger world. You're not leaving again, are you? No. Something tells me the most wonderful discoveries are a little closer to home. <laughs> All right, so that was it. I don't want to say the ending was anticlimactic, it just... I don't know. It seems like there should have been a little more. Like, yeah, Oogie's defeated, but, you know, the kids didn't get their punishment. Jack and Sally are, you know, in the same spot they were always in, so I guess that's good. But the game itself, this was a nice treat. It was a nice surprise. It very much is in the, uh, the vein of Devil May Cry type stuff, especially considering this is a Capcom game. 
Um, definitely not as uh, difficult, though. Uh, I don't want to say that it's easy, but it's... it's uh, I think there's a preciseness in Devil May Cry that this doesn't have. Like, there's more leeway for error. But I really did enjoy playing this. The music was a nice treat. It took me a while to get through it, so I guess it was worthwhile. And I did do a lot of playing off-screen to get my uh, ranks up. And I think I will keep doing that until I've S-ranked every stage. And maybe I'll do a uh, bonus video showing off all the stuff we've unlocked. But that's mostly it. So I really enjoyed playing this. If you enjoyed it, please go out and give it a chance yourself. If you want games in this vein, um, like I said, I kept mentioning Devil May Cry because Devil May Cry sort of... I want to say defined, or redefined, this kind of gameplay style. Like, we had all kinds of action games and beat-em-up games before Devil May Cry, but I think the people at Capcom really got it right with that first game, and it sort of set the tone for all the games that we're going to follow. So, check out the Devil May Cry games if this caught your attention. What else might be a good... Uh, Bayonetta might be a good one to take a look at. Uh, even the older God of War games might be at least mechanically along those lines. I don't know, do I... Uh, I don't think Onimusha is quite... is quite right. Onimusha's more... Um, I, I want to say, like, timing. Because Onimusha, yeah, it is kind of like that. It's more of, like, precision timing than uh, careful use of uh, actions. But Onimushas are really good, too, so you if you might get a, some enjoyment out of that. So, I guess that does it. Thank you all so, so very much for watching. I always appreciate it, and I will see you all in the next game. Take care.